Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Nicole Kidman and Tom Cruise may have been one of Hollywood's most popular couples back in the 90s, but it seems like the Oscar-winning actress prefers not to talk about her ex-husband. During a recent interview to promote her latest film, Being the Ricardos, Nicole slammed a journalist for bringing up her previous marriage with Tom Cruise. Here's everything you need to know about how Nicole Kidman called out a sexist question. Number 5. Nicole Kidman's New Film Nicole Kidman recently opened up about her latest role in the film Being the Ricardos during an interview with The Guardian. But before we get to the details of the interview and the question that particularly angered the actress, let's talk a bit about the movie itself. Being the Ricardos is a biographical drama film which was released on 10th December 2021. It narrates the story of a Hollywood power couple from the 50s and 60s, I Love Lucy stars Lucille Ball and Desi Arnaz as they navigate their relationship while dealing with personal and professional obstacles. The role of Arnaz is played by Spanish actor Javier Bardem, while Lucille's character is portrayed by Nicole Kidman. Number 4. Interview with The Guardian Now, coming back to Kidman's promotional interview, the 54-year-old actress talked to the British newspaper about her unique experience of playing Lucille Ball in the film, and how the plot somewhat relates to her own life. It's about a creative and romantic relationship that doesn't work out, but from it come some extraordinary things, and I love that. I love that it's not a happy ending, Kidman said, hinting at Arnaz and Lucille's real-life divorce in 1960. Nicole went on to explain the deeper meaning behind the story and said, This film says you can make an extraordinary relationship thrive and leave remnants of that that exist forever. Yeah, that's really gorgeous. You can't make people behave how you want them to, and sometimes you're going to fall in love with someone who isn't going to be the person you spend the rest of your life with. And I think that's all very relatable. You may have kids with them, you may not, but they were very much in love. Number 3. The Sexist Question Assuming that the Big Little Lies actress was talking about her former marriage to Tom Cruise, the reporter asked Nicole if she, in fact, was referring to her ex. Oh my god, no, no, absolutely not, Kidman instantly replied. No, I mean, that's honestly so long ago that that isn't in this equation, so no. But that's not all that she said. Turns out the actress found this question particularly sexist and uncalled for, which is why she went on to slam the reporter for bringing up her past relationship. And I would ask not to be pigeonholed that way either, Kidman continued. It feels to me almost sexist because I'm not sure anyone would say that to a man. And at some point you go, give me my life in its own right. Number 2. Shared History It's safe to say that whatever happened between Nicole Kidman and Tom Cruise certainly did not end well. The two A-listers first met on the set of their film Days of Thunder back in 1990 and got married at the end of the same year. In 2001, Cruise reportedly filed for divorce and the once talked about couple made headlines with their split. They do have two kids together though, a 26-year-old son Connor and a 28-year-old daughter Isabella. Number 1. Past versus Current Marriage Considering the circumstances in which her previous marriage ended, it isn't too surprising that Nicole is particularly hesitant while answering questions about her past relationship. In fact, the actress has addressed her marriage with Cruz only a handful of times in recent years, that too not so comfortably. In 2018, for instance, she told New York Magazine that she's reluctant to answer questions related to Cruz because talking about her previous marriage almost feels disrespectful to her current husband, Keith Urban. It's been 15 years since the two tied the knot back in 2006 in their native country of Australia. The couple has two children together, Sunday Rose, who's 13 years old, and Faith Margaret, who's 10. Recently, Keith made an appearance on Living and Learning with Reba McIntyre, where he was asked about his biggest accomplishments in life. In response, the musician revealed that marrying Nicole for the right reasons is certainly a massive achievement for him. The actress herself has had something similar about her wedded bliss, although she also clarified that her marriage shouldn't be considered an archetype because every relationship is different. In an interview with Harper's Bazaar earlier this year, the Undoing star also revealed that she thinks she might have been a bit too candid about her love life in the past. Nicole said, I was young, I think I offered it up. Maybe I've gotten a bit more trepidatious, but I'm always trying to be as open as possible. I just prefer to live in the world that way. I'm wary at times and I've been hurt, but at the same time, I much prefer a warm approach rather than a prickly shutdown approach. That's it for today guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit like and subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you stay up to date with our latest content. See you soon.